Good day everyone! In this video, you will learn how to organize your care team on the Contributor Cover Page. This Contributor Cover Page video is a follow-up lesson from creating an at-home care team. By the end of this video, you will be able to easily document your contributors on the cover page that will provide health professionals with a more detailed examination of your entire care team. This video goes a little fast, so to make learning more easy, be sure to watch our previous video. Also, get a printout of the contributor cover page before viewing, and then be sure to watch the video all the way through for the first time, and then go back to the parts where you need more clarity on. Now that we have identified and classified our care team participants, now it's time to organize them on the contributor cover page. The purpose of the contributor cover page is to assist in organizing and structuring participants, as well as help care teams keep focus on coordinating members while under stress. Provide professionals with a snapshot of the entire at-home care team. Document and add accountability to care team contributors, as well as provide care teams with a place to acknowledge the patient's right to privacy. First, let's decide who registers on the contributed cover page. This is basically anyone who is expected to write a journal entry, such as primary caregivers, which are your informal caregivers such as neighbors, drivers, family, and friends, as well as secondary caregivers, who are the caregivers associated with a company such as home health providers or non-medical home care representatives. Now that we have designed our first care team, you will see that documenting them on the contributed cover page is easy. If you haven't done so already, make sure that the contributor cover page is in front of you. Because now we're going to fill it out. The patients and the clearinghouse's information goes at the top right here. Put the primary caregiver's information in this spot. And put the secondary caregiver companies in this area. And make sure that all of the contributors sign the back of this contributor cover page. That way, they can acknowledge the HIPAA compliance agreement, which is featured on the bottom of this page. And you file your contributor cover page in the front pocket of your health manager. And that concludes our video in how to document participants on the contributor cover page. And join me in my next video as we will learn how to navigate through our dashboard.